Hello everyone, my name is Fanning Pepper, and next week I will be running a Scratch Game Jam. A Game Jam is an event where participants try to make a video game from scratch around a certain theme. The Game Jam will start this Saturday, August 16th, at noon Eastern Time, and will run until the end of the day on Saturday, August 24th. If you wish to participate, that's the window of time you'll have to create your game. To decide the theme of this game jam, I'll put up a poll on my community tab with a few different options. If you're interested in participating, I'd encourage you to vote there. Whichever theme gets the most votes will be chosen as the theme for the jam. At the start time, I'll share an empty project on Scratch. All submissions must be remixes of this project. This project's notes will contain the elected theme. I'll unshare the empty project after the jam to remove the remix tag on your project. When you share your project, I'll add it to a Scratch Studio for the game jam. After the game jam is over, I'll play every game and give it a score based on six metrics, and I'll post a video showcasing the highest scoring project. The metrics are... Theme. Does your game fit the game jam's theme? Do different parts of your game go together thematically? Make sure to take note of which theme was chosen. Design. Are different aspects of your game, such as mechanics or levels, well-balanced and well-designed? Is gameplay non-repetitive? Creativity. Are game aspects like mechanics, levels, and setting creative and unique? Difficulty. Is your game challenging, but not overly so? Does it feel fair and fun to play? Keep in mind what constitutes a good difficulty could vary in different game genres. Art. Is your art and or music high quality and well made? Does it fit the game? Polish. Is your game polished? Things that could make it more polished are no bugs, a menu, smooth controls, etc. Keep in mind that in the course of scoring, I will give your project constructive criticism. And if you don't wish to receive constructive criticism, you might choose to not participate in the jam. You may use other people's work, such as art, code, music, or ideas, but if you do so, you absolutely must give credit. You may also use your own code from previous projects, but you must indicate that as well. Failure to give credit will result in your game being disqualified. The borrowed work will not directly increase your project's score. For example, if you use someone else's art, you might not get an especially high art score. That's totally fine, of course, and your project doesn't need to score highly on all the metrics to get a good overall score. With that said, I encourage you to participate and try your hand at making a game. I look forward to seeing all the fun projects you lovely viewers create. But until then, have a great rest of your day, and goodbye!